I live on 170 Atlantic Avenue in Long Branch, New Jersey. Uh, I really wasn't going to get up and say anything, but I uh, felt compelled because of uh, the last person, but not the last person, but the person before this that got up there and started talking about or trying to condemn the fact that you voted for this and you voted for that. Well, when I, I remember 24, 25, 26 years ago, uh, Adam Schneider ran for, for mayor, and that person, De Stefano, was a member of the Clean Sweep team. They're, they're, they were there, and they're, they, they, they campaigned on revitalizing the downtown Long Branch. Now, many of you here probably still see the downtown Long Branch, but 26 or 27 years later, what do we have? The buildings have been torn down, but nothing, there's been no revitalization. Everything is going down to Pier Village, Pier Village, and I live on Atlantic Avenue, and I have a complaint because they're allowing, they're thinking that Pier Village is the greatest thing that ever happened to Long Branch, but in my estimation, which is my personal estimation, it's the worst thing that ever happened to Long Branch because I'm a resident of Long Branch, and in the summertime, I can't even get out of my street because of the fact that the cars go down, they have no other way to get out, but now they've discovered Atlantic Avenue, so they come down Atlantic Avenue rather than going down Jalion Avenue. Now, if you think that that's progress or that's helping the, the people of Long Branch, I, I happen to be the commissioner, the, the, the Democratic committee person in my area, and everybody comes and complains to me about things that are going on, you know what I mean? And I know that, that this, 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 is, this shouldn't be. So all I'm saying is, and I'm not here to condemn anybody, because a lot of you on the council weren't even members of the council. The only one that I know is Dr. Selly. I do know that the Stefano and, and some other people, they were all part of the clean sweep team, which did nothing for Long Branch. And he has the audacity to come up here and try to protect, but he left. There, there had to be a reason why he left, but he did. Okay, so all I'm saying is that, that I'm not here to, to, to criticize anybody. I like everybody. But I think that after 20 some years trying to do something for the people of Long Branch and the people are unhappy with what goes on, I think it's time for you to move over and let someone else have the, the position. So that's, my, that's my thought. Because, because if I recall correctly, if I recall correctly, the last election we had here in Long Branch, 15% of the registered voters voted. 15%. Or 15 or 18%. And that's a pretty low percentage if you have a mayor who's doing something for the people of the town. You understand me? So I'm saying, you understand me? Move over, let somebody else do the job that you have not been able to do. That's all I can say.